Hello everyone, this is Harlambos Pissuros, Senior Technical Analyst here at AeronFX Global, bringing you the technical updates for November 11th. Today I would like to describe the technical picture of uh, sterling dollar ahead of the UK employment report uh, for September. I would also like to talk about DAX futures which uh, fell below the uptrend line taken from the low of the 2nd of October. So let's start our treatment with uh, the sterling dollar currency pair. GBP USD traded higher yesterday, breaking above the resistance. Now turned into support uh, zone of 151.40. The rate now could be headed towards uh, the 152 barrier, where. Uh, a clear break could extend the positive move towards the next resistance at 152.50. Today we get the UK employment report for September, where the employment rate is expected to have remained unchanged, but average weekly earnings are forecast to have accelerated. This could be the trigger for the move above the 152 zone. Our short-term momentum studies support the notion as well. The RSI moved uh, higher and tested its uh, 50 line, while the MACD, although negative, emerged above its uh, trigger line and is now pointing north. Switching to the daily chart, I see that the rate is trading well below the 80-day exponential moving average, which has started uh, turning down. Therefore, I would see a cautiously negative longer-term picture, and I would treat the recent rebound or any extensions of it that stay limited below the 80-day EMA as uh, a corrective phase for now. Now let's continue with uh, DAX futures. DAX futures fell below the uptrend line taken from uh, the low of the 2nd of October and subsequently they consolidated below the 10900 uh, resistance zone. Taking into account the break below the trend line and having in mind our momentum signs, I see the possibility for the index to correct lower in the near term. The RSI turned down after it hit 50, while the MACD, already below its trigger line, has just obtained a negative sign. There is also negative divergence between both these indicators and the price action. A decisive dip below the 10,670 line could uh, confirm further correction and could challenge the psychological zone of uh, 10,500 as a support this time. On the daily chart, the break above the psychological zone of 10,500 on, on the 22nd of October signaled the completion of a double bottom formation. This keeps the medium term outlook uh, positive and as a result I would uh, consider any further short term declines as a retracement uh, for now. So that's it for today. For more analysis and charts please read the full comment on ironfx.com you can also follow us on Twitter, like us on Facebook, subscribe to our YouTube channel, or circle us on Google Plus to get more trading ideas. This is Haralambos Pissuros, Senior Technical Analyst at IronFX Global, wishing you solid trading.